Filming is well underway in the second series of the hit BBC drama, The Fall. I catch up with the lead actor, Jamie Dornan, and the writer-director, Alan Cubitt. You can't predict that people are going to be, you know, are going to enjoy a show or feel it's compelling or it captures the imagination in some kind of way. So it's gratifying when it happens, but it's hard to know quite why it happens. I mean, certainly, if you cast Gillian and Jamie, then maybe you're on a strong territory in the first place. And Jamie, because you're a character, he's a killer, but he also seems to be a very caring man. He has a family who do scenes with children. How difficult is it to play that character? Yeah, I don't think it's, <laughs> it's not a breeze, <laughs> certainly, but um, I relish it and I love it. And I, I, I've said this in the past that I, I've, approached Spectre as two different characters because I think that that makes the most sense it made it easier for me to to relate to what I was doing in either mode in either sort of killing mode or or you know family mode both equally difficult actually neither easier than other I've come to ask you to beg you if necessary to give me another chance Jamie what difference does it make for you that you're filming in your home place it's lovely to, to be here um, I've sort of got a different sense of Belfast than I did uh, when I lived here previously when I was you know growing up and at school and everything and I have a huge appreciation for it you know not that I didn't before but you know you come back a slightly more slightly more adult and um, and you you approach the city differently and um, you get more from it I think than just being at school and you know drinking and doing whatever he did growing up in Belfast, um, playing a bit of sport. Yeah. Um, I'm sort of appreciating it more as a whole, as a city, and um, yeah, I love it, yeah. It's what you believe that matters. Then let me go. I think a lot of these dramas that are successful have a very strong sense of place, that there is, you know, to use a cliche, that the, the city in which they take place becomes a bit of a character. Uh, the idea of it being a small city where the reverberations of these crimes might be more keenly felt a city where actually crimes like that have not traditionally taken place and in fact i'm glad to say so far haven't really taken place also was appealing and you know i'm fascinated by the history of the place as well so allowing some of that to feed through you know you know through for example your senior police officer through a character like burns played by john lynch that his career will have spanned some of those troubled years and that will inform his mindset that will be part of his thinking so and, and you know it is a great city to live and work as well the first series ended on a cliffhanger without giving it away could you tell us a little bit about what the second series has in store not really no <laughs> <laughs> but it scares me 